All righty, we're rolling here. We've got a big project ahead of us today. Do we? Yes. <laughs> we do. I will be working with you. Okay. There's been lots of stuff this week that we've been doing separate, hard jobs, and at the end of the day you're like, oh, my day was so hard. <laughs> my day was hard. Editing videos really hard. <laughs> we we now have to combine our animals. So because we're yeah. moving shut up. Because we're moving into a barn that already has some animals in it, we're gonna kinda squeeze in here and make some room. So I'm doing a lot of cleaning and figuring out where we want our, our milking stanchion to go, where the cows will go if we need to, where the goats are gonna go. I mean, it's a lot of cleaning and some designing. Ooh, so we have to rearrange this barn for larger livestock and more livestock. So today we're gonna focus on the inside. We wanna clean up the outsides. Because when we got here, we kind of just unloaded our stuff and set it in front of the barn. So now it'd be nice to get it cleaned up. What does it look like out there? Like, uh, like a, a, a picker's. A, a, I was gonna say, like a, um, a farm auction is going on yeah. outside. I could just stand outside and start shouting out numbers. And... Maybe I'll just do that. We finished. $25, $25, $25, $26, dollars $27 to the man in the suit with the large hand. You're being funny. I was being funny. I missed it. I missed the funniness. You missed my funny. Oh, Special yeah. thanks to Uncle Bourbon for forgetting his hat and it being the only hat I can find inside right now. So that's great. <laughs> Shall we get to, get to work? All right, let's get to work. <laughs> She can roll them wherever she needs to. She's not dealing with those heavy bags of feed. This, when I lived here, is what we were dealing with. This grain bin, which he also made, but it's a little hard to get the bags in and out of there. This will be great for us. Even we can have the kids feed the chickens now. It's so easy to access, to roll around, to have a scoop of feed out and to feed everybody. It's really nice. So smart. All right, Sweepy McSweeperson, let's go. Austin wants me to tell this story because he likes it. When I lived here, one of my favorite things to do was to clean the barn. We'd get all dusty, full of horse manure, chickens and stuff. So I'd come out here, we had a cassette player in the tack room and 
I don't know, at some point there was an Aerosmith cassette put in there. So I'd blast my Aerosmith <laughs> and clean the barn. It always felt so nice to clean the barn. To this day, there's nothing nicer than a clean barn. And now you know, right? Loving in an elevator! That's not my favorite Aerosmith song. <laughs> I can't even think of an Aerosmith song. Yeah, you're right. Loving in an elevator is Aerosmith. That's the only one I know. <laughs> Angel? Do you know that one? Angel, how's it go? Angel, come no, and save me tonight. Angel! Talk? Done. Now we gotta do the front. Right, babe? Uh, feeling an espresso break? Not yet. You haven't earned it. What are we it's doing? Okay. We're, we're going to put the hay bales in the back of the gator and take them up to where we're dumping this stuff right now. They're old moldy hay bales, so I want to get rid of them. Even if Austin wants to keep them. Cleaning is always more fun with ATVs. This place looks so good. Well, that was a ton of work, but uh, the barn looks fantastic. We got a nice curb appeal out here. Everything's really coming together. Kate was talking about today, it's all about these little victories. Just getting something done and then looking and saying, wow, that looks great. That make you feel like you can do it. So here we are, little victories. I, by the way, uh, have showered up. We're gonna head out and go out to dinner. That's why I'm in like my fancy clothes here. So we're gonna take the kids out, uh, probably get some, go to a restaurant nearby, and uh, relax tonight, have a little dinner out. And then tomorrow, you won't believe where we're going tomorrow. Make sure to join our email list so you get tomorrow's video sent to you in your inbox like we do every Friday, popping balloons over here. And uh, stay tuned for tomorrow's video.